Boston has played an incredible role in American history. So today we're taking a walk along the Freedom Trail and we're gonna learn how to take incredible photos along the way. A photo walks tour is very different because not only are you going to learn the history of Boston, but you're also gonna learn how to take creative pictures. So the Freedom Trail is actually identified by a red brick line that carries through the city, identifying the most historic spots in Boston. This is a really cool shot in black and white. One of the first stops is here in the Granary Burial Grounds, which dates back to the mid-1600s. There's over 5,000 people buried here, including John Hancock, Samuel Adams, and Paul Revere. The Omni Parker Hotel is the oldest hotel in all of America, and it's actually where John F. Kennedy proposed to Jackie Onassis. This is a great shot because we have some great clouds. We really learned how to avoid the typical touristy kind of photo and be more artistic in the way we were looking at the historical moments. This is the State House, where the British laws were read to Bostonians, and ironically enough, in 1776, the Declaration of Independence was first read. I recommend it for anybody, whether you're a local or whether you're someone just wanting to see Boston. It's a terrific tour. And the last stop is here at the home of the infamous Paul Revere in the North End, Boston's oldest neighborhood. This walk along the Freedom Trail here in Boston has been incredible. I've improved my photography skills, but also learned so much about American history.